It was a beautiful night for baseball at Wrigley Field between the Washington Nationals and the Chicago Cubs. The Nationals come in five and a half games back in the NL East and are four and a half games out of a wild card spot. The Cubs come into tonight's game with a two game lead over the Brewers. The two teams have split the series so far, so tonight is a rubber match. Let's get to the action. Five NL wins leader Max Scherzer shows the rubber for the Nationals. Second Top the second, two on, nobody two. out. Mark Reynolds and lines one to the right fielder Hayward. Jason and Hayward, who has a big arm. Let's see if they Zimmerman test it. The Ryan Zimmerman tags from third plate. The plate, he's safe. Bottom of the third. Scherzer facing Javier Baez. Baez flails at a slider outside the zone and shows his frustration afterwards. Scherzer had his great stuff tonight. He's facing Baez again in the sixth. This time he climbs the ladder with a high fastball. Scherzer would go seven innings, striking out 11 Cubs. Bottom of the eighth. Coda Glover in facing Baez. Baez looking to break his 0 for 3 skid as he grounds this one to Reynolds who throws on the first. And the first base umpire rules him safe. They would have to take a look at it. And here you see the angle, and they do call him out. Top nine, Zimmerman looking for a base hit with the bases loaded. He grounds one up the middle. Trey Turner comes around to score. Juan Soto also comes around to score. Nats go up three to one. David Bodie comes in to pinch hit with the bases loaded and two outs. Bodie crushes one to center field. And gone. He hit an ultimate grand slam. First ultimate grand slam since Ryan Roberts in 2011 as the Cubs would go on to win in dramatic fashion. There you see the bat flip from David Bodie. The Cubs bench celebrates an exciting 4-3 victory. Cubs rookie David Bodie was the hero tonight as the Cubs win 4-3 in ceremonial fashion. For the Nationals, they have a quick turnaround and will head to St. Louis tomorrow for a four-game series. The Cubs will remain home and take on the Milwaukee Brewers on Tuesday afternoon.